Hello, my name is Scott Wells. I am a paradoxologist. What is a paradoxologist, you wonder? Well, I knew what you were wondering, and that explains what I do. In fact, the definition of the word paradox is a statement or proposition that seems self-contradictory or absurd, but in reality expresses a possible truth. The origin of the word paradoxos means unbelievable or beyond belief. In other words, as a paradoxologist, I create wonder. Wonder not only how I did it, but did you really see what you think you saw? I am going to try to make a psychic connection with you here over the internet. But don't worry, I won't reveal any of your intimate secrets here in public, but I will try to influence your decision with a rather small, insignificant experiment. We will use a few innocuous playing cards to conduct this experiment and you will see them displayed as we create this circle of cards. I say experiment because, well, tricks work. But this will only work if you follow my instructions and believe that we can make a psychic connection. Okay, take a look at the cards in this circle. Notice that they all have values, numbers, or indices. They are all randomly displayed, and some are clubs, some are hearts, some are diamonds, and some are spades. Some are red, and some are black. Look at and concentrate on one card, one red card. Now come closer to the screen, and actually put your finger on that red card of your choice. Using that number, make that many clockwise moves around the circle to a new number. Now, do it again with that new number, moving again clockwise to yet another card. Remember that card, because that will be your lucky card. Now relax. Forget about the troubles, the woes, and worries of the day, and anything that may be causing you stress. Just relax and focus on your lucky card. Concentrate on your lucky card, and I'll try to receive your thought. Hmm, I don't think it's that card, or that card. And I think we can eliminate these, perhaps in these two. That leaves us with these four, but I don't think your lucky card is one of these two. So we're down to two. I want you to say the name of your lucky card out loud now. All right, let's eliminate one more card. This one. That leaves us with one card, the Ten of Spades your lucky card. Thank you for helping with this experiment. And don't worry, your secrets are safe with me.